we need to figure out how to get this girl on a nap schedule. Uh, yeah, you. <laughs> so right now, we go by her schedule. Because like I've said before, she's the boss. When she first came home from the hospital, we would do like at least one nap a day in her bassinet downstairs. Because we had like a little portable one down there. But the, yes, honey, she outgrew that one. So, and now she's in the big girl crib. Um, but she only sleeps in there at night. We tried yesterday practicing. I put her in the crib to play, thinking that, like, maybe she'd fall asleep. She didn't fall asleep. And she ended up in her little bouncer in the bathroom with me as I did my hair. <laughs> At this point, we do, like, two, like, cat naps a day, like, on me. Like, I'll hold her and she'll nap. But I'm thinking we need to at least get in the habit of doing one nap a day in the crib. Yes. Leave your tips down below in the comments because we're going to need all the help we can get, Kenny girl. <laughs>